Hey, what's up, good people? This is Tori with Dating Right, and in this video, we're gonna be discussing Jay Ellis. I remember him from the show The Game and Issa's Ray Insecure. Recently, he's been making news this week because he got married to his white girl, longtime girlfriend, and it's causing a little bit of fray online because he posted a picture of her and him at their wedding, and he turned the comments off. And all the black women seem to be going in over the fact that he turned his comments off. And I'm like, people turn their comments off all the time. It's not a big deal. Sometimes on certain posts, you turn your comments off. You already know what's coming. But the interesting part is that why are black women so triggered by the fact that he turned the comments off and it's almost like people are upset that they couldn't comment on this man's post social media is just a powerful drug the way people stay concerned about people they never met it is totally amazing but when a black woman marry a white man or another man out of a race you know, most men, we don't say anything about it. Now, you got some men who will be corny and lame and will say something about it. But, you know, to be honest, me, I don't have an issue with it. I'm happy for sis. I believe all of us should be in love and find love. I don't care where you find it. We are human beings. We was not put on this earth to be alone. We was put on this earth to be with someone. That's how it works. When God made Adam, he saw that Adam wasn't happy. He say, I'm going to take a part of his rib and make Eve. And he made Eve and, you know, and it went downhill from there. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not going to go there. I don't knock black women who diverse or whatever. And it will never be an issue for me. I want you to be happy, sis. So go find whoever you need to find. Just, just realize that he's a man too. Regardless of his color, he will make mistakes as well. Anyways, back to my point. Why was women so triggered by the fact that Jay Ellis turned his comments off? And I'm not even gonna get into the fact that he been posted his wife months ago and everybody been who, well, he been posted his girlfriend months ago and everybody knew who she was. What is the issue when a black man marry a woman outside of the race? But let's, let's dissect that for a second. Just like most black men who go outside of their race, they, remember times that when maybe they was in middle school or high school a lot of the younger black women wasn't checking for them because they was quoted as corny or lame or he's a you know swear type dude when a lot of the women in our culture they wanted the guy they wanted the bad guy they wanted little ro ro and little tay tatum and um no big run them black robbed them black robbed them was balling they was riding around in the ferraris the dope boys the um scammers all that that's what women wanted the fast money the action the guy that's gonna pay for everybody when they go out to eat you know what i mean but you know a guy like jay ellis maybe i don't know his past but he looked like a guy that was you know educated in school so a lot of women went checking for him but guess who was checking for him becky and sarah was checking for him you know, and they just open it up, just open up a, a friendship with him and he got to know them. So the brothers, you know, eventually fell in love with the woman and it started from a genuine place. And that's how it would have happened if black women was checking for Jay. 
you know, but they wasn't. So once the brother started his um, acting career, he was able to go forward and get some things going on with the actual woman that he's with now. And I think a lot of black women view it as, oh, this man is successful. He's reached his highest level. He should be with a black queen. And I don't always agree with that. Like I said, I feel like people can find love anywhere. But for for black women to be so triggered about it, it's like, why? And shout out to Jay Ellis, by the way. Jay Ellis, Jay Ellis just did a um, the Top Gun movie. And he was also in another previous movie. I think they're positioning him to replace Will Smith. To be honest, he's a great Will Smith lookalike. Let's keep it real. So congratulations to him. And, uh, congratulations on his marriage. Um, I don't think a lot of men feel some type of way about that. These are the type of things that men are happy to see other men doing to bring peace into their life and to help, you know, move them forward. Because we also know a lot of men like Denzel Washington and Michael P. Jordan who got to hide the fact that if they do date a woman out of another race, they almost got to hide it. Congratulations for him for being honest and upfront. And I think that's the best way to approach it is let people see who you're with so they can stop, you know, they can stop talking about it or trying to get you in the press or get you on TMZ. So I'm glad I'm happy for the brother. So let me know what you think down below. Do you think Jay Ellis should have turned his comment section off or should he have left it on? And um, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Let me know what you think down below and I'll see you in the next video.